Utopia for me is probably bringing the first time where I've experienced this sense of an entrepreneurial space mixed with entrepreneurship and innovation management regarding the SDGs. So this is my first experience working with these methodologies of the hackathon. And what we are tackling on this hackathon, it's how to solve uh, the problems that public and private partnerships uh, are facing regarding good distribution. We have talked to many experts, like one public procurer from the University of Gothenburg, also with an, another stakeholder, and now uh, we have just yes, have a keynote uh, speech from one guy that it was like really an expert. So I'm learning a lot of things from this world of uh, also like logistic distribution and how that affects, affects our planet. So I'm asking the students uh, just to which are the uh, your insights, so write them down. You have two minutes to think about them, you have two minutes to discuss them, you have two minutes to present them. So I think it was like for us very surprising at first that uh, this was expected, was expected to be in Gothenburg, but now it's becoming online and that for like at first it seemed like kind of awkward that something that was supposed to be like a lot of students in Gothenburg is going to be just in a room with five of us. But I think like it's turning pretty well. In our team at the UPF team, we have joined um, uh, a student from VUB, the University of Brussels, Jasmine, which is also collaborating with us in our team. So I think what mainly Utopia brings to us is, um, as I said, the experience of uh, getting to know other cultures, but mainly focusing on very important topics that maybe we have seen in our degrees, respectively. Um, around sustainability, also like project development and management, which I think it's very important for the professional careers. So this started like uh, two and a half years ago when we decided uh, that we were going to uh, do an Open Innovation Challenge program with our students. So we first, what we first did is to try to tackle which were the, our challenges regarding SDGs. So the experience is not winning the hackathon, but all the learnings that are, they are doing in a very intense process in three days. So they started yesterday, they had no idea what a public procurement was. And so 24 hours later, I think I can tell that they at least they have very small notions, but notions of public procurements and European stakeholders.